This is a strengthening question. We have to strengthen the position of Bursar and Bursar says that no, that is not the case as in the philosophy department is not wasting supplies. So we need something to suggest that the philosophy department is not wasting supplies. Look at answer choice A. Choice A says that there are more faculty members in the English department and if anything, in such a case, the English department should be consuming more supplies. It is the philosophy department which is consuming more supplies. So answer choice A is not strengthening the position of Mr. Bursar. Answer choice A is weakening his position. So answer choice A should be eliminated. Look at answer choice B now. This talks about five years ago. So the numbers may have been different five years ago. Everything may have been different. So answer choice B is out of scope. This cannot strengthen or weaken the argument. Look at answer choice C now. English department members found it more convenient to go to the supplies cabinet of the philosophy department. So it is likely that some of the English department members are using the supplies from the cabinet of the philosophy department rather than using supplies from the cabinet of the English department. And this explains why the consumption from the supplies cabinet of the philosophy department is more than the consumption from the cabinets of the English department. So this answer choice gives a legitimate reason for the difference in consumption and therefore this weakens the stand that the philosophy department may be wasting supplies and in effect this answer choice strengthens the stand of Mr. Bursar that no, the philosophy department is not wasting the supplies. So answer choice C is likely the correct answer choice here. Look at answer choice D. This is something that applies to both the departments and therefore this does not contribute to the reasoning here. Answer choice D cannot weaken or strengthen the argument. This is not the correct answer choice. Look at answer choice E now. The philosophy department's work now requires a wider variety of office supplies than it used to. This is a trap here. This talks about the requirement being wider than the requirement earlier. See the argument has anyway said that the expenditures for philosophy department are higher. Now the variety required also being higher is just operational detail. This has no impact on the reasoning. Answer choice E is a trap. It does not do anything to suggest that there may not be wastage. Answer choice C on the contrary gives an alternate reason suggesting that English department members may be using the office supplies from the cabinet of philosophy department. This explains why the English department cabinets have lower expense compared to the philosophy department cabinets. And in effect, this answer choice suggests that the philosophy department may not be wasting supplies and therefore answer choice C supports the position here that no, the philosophy department is not wasting supplies. C is the correct answer choice.